So while there are a host of different factors that might influence body image concerns, social media has been identified as one potential factor that might increase appearance pressures for young people. While social media can be a great tool to connect, to uh, be a source of entertainment and identity development, in general, the research does tend to find that increased time spent on social media and particularly appearance focused content online can have a negative effect on young people's body image, although this effect does tend to be small. There's considerable variation in how young people use social media in terms of the content that they engage in, the, the motives that drive them to engage in content, the way that they interpret the messages and the behaviours they engage in. So this might explain why some young people might be more susceptible to the effects of social media while others might be largely unaffected. But in general, it's thought that increased time on social media, particularly appearance focused platforms like social media or like Instagram or Snapchat and engaging in appearance related behaviors like posting uh, photos of oneself, viewing images online or editing photos is associated with higher levels of body dissatisfaction. Also, individuals who spend more time uh, in investing in their self-appearance online or their self-presentation or editing photos of themselves also tend to exhibit higher levels of body dissatisfaction. Social media contains a profusion of appearance-focused content. And because we're so constantly exposed to this idealized content, it can uh, create a kind of distort our perceptions of what a normal body looks like. And it can create pressures to attain these idealized bodies, which for the most, uh, for, which for most people are largely unattainable. Also, when we compare ourselves to idealized images online, it can highlight discrepancies between our own bodies and that of the ideal bodies that we see. And this can create body dissatisfaction. And because there's the editing and the filtering on social media, it can widen this perceived discrepancy between our bodies and the idealized lives that we're seeing and our lived experience and this uh, projected image that we see online. And so this can also magnify body image concerns. And also social media has likes, comments, followers. And again, this creates almost a quantitative validation of appearance which can heighten pressures to present the perfect version of oneself online. So these are ways in which social media can add to appearance pressures for young people. That said, social media can be positive for body image. It contains a, quite a wealth of diverse different body types that are celebrated online. It contains platforms and communities um, and uh, kind of social structures within the, the platforms that promote healthy messages about body image. And that can be really promotive and inspiring for young people. So in terms of take homes, Social media is a central aspect of adolescents' lives and it can be an empowering space for identity development, but sometimes it can magnify the appearance pressures experienced by young people. If your young person is struggling with body image concerns, encouraging them to reflect on their social media use and how it makes them feel, selecting helpful content and avoiding unhelpful content, and crucially encouraging your child to be kinder and more compassionate with themselves if they do experience appearance concerns can be helpful for fostering healthier body image.